The California wildfires have burned more than a million acres of land and destroyed over 2,000 structures. And those people who have found themselves homeless are getting a helping hand from a local Idahoan who's seen it all before firsthand. Idaho News 6 reporter Stephanie Garibay spoke with the Red Cross volunteer about how he's once again helping displaced families find shelter. People have lost 2,600 homes that have been, or structures that have been lost, and over 800 homes have been lost in my region, District 2, uh, since the fire started, and it's just devastating for these people. When Paul Ayers, a Boise resident, received a deployment notification from the Red Cross, he had 24 hours to pack his things and start heading to California. This was his fourth deployment with the Red Cross, one that would be significant because it was the second largest wildfire in California history and during a pandemic. Very tough to see these people um, as they're trying to put their life back together and move forward. And is the generosity of people to help them is, is just overwhelming. So uh, it's been a, a sad experience, but it's it's been a very good experience to to be here. The last time Paul was in California with the Red Cross was during the Paradise Campfire in 2018, the deadliest and most destructive wildfire in California history that burned more than 150,000 acres. But this time things were different because of the pandemic. COVID-19, of course, is throwing a huge monkey wrench into any of these operations. So things that we used to do in person, such as spiritual care or mental health counseling uh, is done virtually now versus you know sitting in a city next to somebody and talking with them. Paul is spending his two weeks in California working to help displaced families find shelter. He tells Idaho News 6 being able to help families through this is bittersweet. Very sad to see what people go through. It's uh, it just makes us appreciate the things that we have more. In Twin Falls, I'm Stephanie Garibay, Idaho News 6. And if you would like to help families affected by the wildfires in California, you can donate to the Red Cross and you can visit our website, IdahoNews6.com, for more information.